Yeah. What's up? How are you? I just feel like I kind of took the approach, you know, taking it day by day, just getting better. Um, definitely at first had to adjust, you know, to the pro life, you know, those double teams are coming different, those blocks are coming different, you know, guys are just, you know, older, more seasoned. Uh, just kind of had to adjust to the game a little bit, but but so far I feel like I've been getting better each and, each and every single week. Um, it's been a little bit of an adjustment. Uh, I feel like uh, I was asked to play a little bit more vertical, I feel like, in uh, college. But now uh, I feel like I've been playing pretty much everywhere. So just kind of trying to, you know, find the best spot, wherever coach says uh, for me to play at and to help the team out. Uh, that's kind of the approach I've been taking, just trying to absorb all the information they've been coaching me up on. Yeah, for sure. Uh, definitely, me getting those, uh, you know, those snaps in the games. I definitely help. I definitely think it's helped me get along faster. I feel like just, you know, playing against those guys, you know, each every team, you know, some of those guys being Pro Bowlers. I felt like I gotten better each every week. Um, so he definitely was a guy that I was watching in college. Uh, just the amount of success he had, especially during, you know, the 2016 uh, Super Bowl run that they had. Uh, that's when I first noticed him. But just having that type of guy in the room that you can bounce ideas off of, talk about things that you're going through as a rookie, you know, him also being the fifth-round pick and me being the fifth-round pick, I felt like it's kind of it's kind of been a good thing, kind of being like his little brother and, and watching the things that, he, like, things that he does, you know. Yeah, I'm looking forward to this offseason to not being not being draft prep, you know what I mean? To actually get a full offseason, lift weights, condition, you know, really push myself physically before year two. I think it'll be a huge help for me. Uh, personally, for me, I think physically, I've been pretty fine. I've been pretty healthy. Uh, you know, there's some weeks you're more sore than others, but I feel like the biggest challenge for a rookie that I went through is probably the mental grind of playing like that many more games and trying to stay focused during that time. Uh, but I feel like I've tried to adjust. I've tried to lean on guys like Grady, Tyler Davidson, guys that have been through it. They've been through their rookie year already. And just leaning on them, I think, has helped me like a lot. Uh, can you repeat that for me? Yeah, just like, how do you think that playing well late in games, like how do you think, you know, playing well under pressure, how do you think that that, that kind of helps you grow? What did, like, did you learn from those moments, like when you did well in the game? Yeah, honestly, I feel like, you know, you want to be, you know, one of the top players in the game someday. I feel like great players show up uh, and they show up in, they show up late in games, like when it matters, you know, one score games, close games, overtime, like whatever. In crunch time, I feel like that's when you should play your best ball, when you really got to lock in and focus. Um, I feel like it's been pretty good for me. I've been taking it week by week, uh, not taking anything for granted, you know what I mean? Uh, just really trying to grind it out, trying to help the team win, trying to play all, 
all over, all up and down the line if they ask me to, you know what I mean? And But so far, so good. I feel like I had a pretty decent rookie year. Uh, definitely made some mistakes I wish I haven't didn't make. But, you know, looking back on everything, watching the tape, I feel like I'm progressing pretty well. Uh, I know that uh, after we we're done with all our meetings, we always have a pass rush meeting on Thursday. We talk about the plan. Uh, Grady actually runs it. We talk about the plan, what we're going to do, how we're going to attack offensive lines. Uh, we even watch the tape uh, from the past week, and we kind of just look at little spots where we can get better, how we can put more pressure on the QB.